Well, Carmen, for over the past several weeks, these artists have been working hard to try to bring this mural back to life just in time for the Hartford Juneteenth celebration happening next weekend. They say that this act of hate will not deter them from their message of love. When I arrived, my letter was vandalized. I was, I was a little down when I found out this morning, um, but um, when I got here, I, I don't know, I just got this like motivation and like the first thing I did was cover it up. Latoya Delaire is just one of the artists working on the refreshed Black Lives Matter mural in downtown Hartford after recent road work. Each letter in the Black Lives Matter mural has a different theme by varying artists. Latoya's theme, Together We Rise. And how ironic it is that they put the ugliness right where she was going to put her heart. So the work that we're doing in the community, it matters. Black lives matter. And we want to cover all the ugliness with some hearts, with some love. City and state leaders are reacting to the vandalism. Mayor Luke Bronin saying in a statement in part, quote, whoever scrawled this swastika and message of white supremacy is a miserable, small, hate-filled person who wants us divided and afraid. But our Hartford community is united, diverse, loving, and strong. We're angry about this vile act of hate, but we are not weakened by it. Mayor Bronin going on to say that Hartford police are investigating to find whoever is responsible. Governor Ned Lamont saying he was disgusted to hear about the graffiti on the mural, saying in a statement that this is not Connecticut values, urging the community to denounce any message of hate and that, quote, we will not be threatened by the messages of anonymous people who attempt to divide us and instill fear. The artists say seeing the response from community leaders inspires them. Well, to see the community come out and the leaders responding by saying, hey, come back and do the mural again, it gives us hope. Hope to send a message that love is stronger than hate. Spread, spread the love, love one another. Now, despite this recent vandalism, the mural is still expected to be completed by time of the Juneteenth uh, Hartford celebration happening next weekend. In Hartford, Jake Garcia, Fox 61, Connecticut's news station.